pay close attention during the tryout scene in the first episode of Amazon Prime series A League of Their Own. Two women, one wearing a plaid jacket and the other in a red sweater that contrasts with her puffy white hair, are sitting in the stands and applauding while a group of brave women show off their pitching, batting and fielding skills in hopes of winning spots in the All-American Girls Professional. The two spectators are smiling, as if they know something you don't. They look like people you should recognize but can't quite place. Who are they? Why are they there? Too quickly, the camera moves on. The woman on the left is Shirley Burkovich, who spent three seasons in the Ogble and died in March at 89. Beside her in the red sweater is 95-year-old Maybelle Blair of Sunset Beach. She's one of the few surviving players from the Ogble, which was launched in 1943 to keep baseball alive while many major leaguers were serving in World War II. By every definition, Blair always has been in a league of her own. Leg injuries limited Blair to one game in one Ogba season with the Peoria Red Wings, barely longer than her time on screen in Amazon Prime's reimagined take on the marvelous 1992 movie A League of Their Own. But she has had a lasting impact on baseball through her efforts to keep alive memories of the Ogbel and her passionate advocacy for giving women chances to play baseball. Maybell is definitely a force of nature, said Justine Siegel, whose non-profit Baseball for All is one of Blair's pet cause. Blair depends on a baseball bat-shaped cane to get around, but she lives alone. She hasn't slowed down happily traveling on behalf of Baseball for All, which provides girls the opportunities to play, coach and develop leadership skills, and to publicize the latest version of A League of Their Own, which will premiere on Friday. She's scheduled to throw out the ceremonial first pitch at Dodger Stadium on August 21. She deserves a standing ovation. Her star turn in the series was brief yet significant. Was I lovely? Blair responded when asked about her cameo. If you blinked, you wouldn't see me, but I guess you didn't blink. Each of the eight episodes lasts about an hour. Blair was consulted before filming began for the series, which includes a sassy character named Maybelle. I went to Hollywood, and they had all these papers all over the wall. About 55 writers, I think. And one dog, Blair said of the creation process. That's how it happened. It's amazing how they put that together. I love it. The series isn't a remake of the Penny Marshall directed movie, which was historically accurate but featured characters who were composites of actual members of the Rockford Peaches, 